I think it's just, I mean, policymakers need to step up their game in terms of not, um, you know, you, you can say what you will about some of the major platforms and the choices they've made, but they're also in a position when they are forced to make these choices because, frankly, um, policymakers have outsourced this responsibility, um, maybe by omission uh, rather than some sort of active action. But it's not an easy task. However, I think human rights frameworks are very solid. And I think they have been disregarded, maybe not anymore, but initially to a great extent, partly, I think, because in the US, human rights has a very weird uh, place in, uh, in society when it's something that happens somewhere else and civil and political rights are kind of what you care about. And I think that has also driven this kind of um, you know, processes that haven't taken into account kind of the full um, spectrum of human rights initially. Um, but I think that the work that currently the Special Rapporteur, David, uh, David Kay, is doing, for example, illustrates how, you know, the principles of proportionality and so on and so forth can actually help guide those decisions. And I think, you know, companies might still get it wrong, but I think if you have done a solid exercise of trying to balancing rights and you've really done it, not just, uh, you know, you've just made the decision to just go for freedom of expression, which would be the very American way of, of doing it, uh, then I think uh, you are much less likely to be heavily criticized if you can prove how you went through that process, if you engaged also rights holders and rights holder groups and so on, and you landed on something where there was some sort of consensus around you're still going to automatically remove certain content that maybe shouldn't have been and so on, but then you have processes to deal with that. Uh, and I think that's, that's really, you know, human rights is also about balancing. I mean, that that's just happens in every context. Uh, and, and that's, you know, explicitly allowed within the human rights framework. So, um, and that doesn't mean that it's easy, but I think it's the, it's the only option that's, that's viable.